Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice math problem? You have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 equals to 61. Here we are finding a plus b, where a and b are member of natural number. That is, we have counting number from 1, 2, 3, and so on. Then from here, we can write a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 as a minus b multiplied by a square plus a b then plus b square and it is equal to 61 here then we can separate 61 as 1 multiplied by 61 also it can be equal to 61 multiplied by 1 but we should see from here we should note that a minus b of course will be less than a square plus a b plus b square that means for this first one this one will satisfy this, that this one less than 61, but here 61 is greater than 1, so here we know go. Then, when we equate that, so we have a minus b to be equal to 1 here, then a square plus ab plus b square to be equal to 61 plus b square equals to 61 then from here we make a the subject and here we can say a is now equal to 1 plus b from here then let's substitute a equals to 1 plus b here in this equation then this becomes 1 plus b all square then plus 1 into bracket 1 plus b then b then plus b square will then be equal to 61 from here then when we expand here this same thing as 1 plus 2b plus b square that is this bracket we expand to this then plus b open this bracket we have b plus b square then here we have plus b square which is equal to 61 from here then in the next step we have b square b square plus b square plus b square that's 3b square then plus 2b plus b that's 3b then we have plus 1 then let's take 61 here we call minus 61 then equals to 0 left here then this same thing as 3b square plus 3b then 1 minus 61 that's minus 60 which is equal to 0 here then from here we can divide through by 3 and then this will reduce to b square plus b then minus 20 will then be equal to 0 here then this quadratic equation here we can factorize and uh, this will be plus 5b minus 4b here this the sum of this will give us plus b and the product will give us minus 20b squared so we have b squared then plus 5b minus 4b minus 20 now equal to 0 between these two what is common we have b out then b plus 5 then minus 4 common here into bracket b so we have b plus 5 as well then equals to 0 because minus times plus here will be minus then b plus 5 common we bring it out that's b plus 5 then into bracket b minus 4 
left then he equals to zero so the two possible cases here we have v plus five equals to zero or we have v minus four equals to zero then from here we have v equals to minus five and on this side we have v equals to four and since we said a and b are member of natural number it implies that b equals to minus five is not possible in this case so we go for b equals to four then we can find the value of a from this relation here when we have a equals to one plus b then that means a will now be equals to from that relation which is a equals to one plus b it implies that a will now be equals to one plus four which means from here that a is equals to five now from here now therefore the value of a plus b that we are finding will now be the same thing as four that is a that's five plus four same thing so that's five plus four and here that's same thing as nine so we can say therefore a plus b here is equals to nine and uh, that's the solution to the problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more exciting videos give a thumbs up put your comments and share this video thank you see you in the next class and bye for now